Hey everyone, Mike Rogers here, Key West, um, Hurricane Irma, Friday, I think this is a 7 o'clock update, and um, people, I just, I want to, I want to do a little heart to heart for a moment, you know, we, we get in our, our phones are blowing up with text messages, phone calls, I know everybody's concerned about us, we know what the storm is doing, um, we're trying to do our last minute preparations, um, it, really we, most of us feel like it's too late to leave, um, the roads are stopped. The uh, there's out of fuel. Uh, anything we go to the west, excuse me, anything we go to the east of us, we're just going to be putting ourselves further into the storm. Uh, right now, it's showing it's going to hit Marathon, which will put us on the um, on the west side of it, and that's where the safest spot is. It could move, but the people that are here now have made the decision that they're going to stay, and most of us don't have a way out. Um, we've got too many people staying at the house. I could jump in my truck and leave, but I'm not going to leave my family that I have here. Yes, I do have immediate family in other places, but this is my family too. I'm not going to leave them without uh, without anything. I've committed to it, and we have to stay. So, yes, we know what the weather is. We watch the updates. Uh, we see what it is. Um, Captain Mike here, he's been a really good friend. He bought a boat for me. He's been learning everything for the last month. Um, he's well prepared. He knows what we're dealing with. Bo, Bo's been on a boat. He's got his boat right here behind us, and uh, we've tied it off. We've done everything we can. Shay, she's been more than a huge help. We've got her place to stay at. We've got a bunch of stuff stored. Um, all three of these people that I just introduced, we we have provisions stored at each of our places. We all have boats. We all have um, places. We've all got food on our boats. We've got water. If one place survives, we've got everything we need, at least for a week, two weeks. Um, these are our friends right here. All these guys are... Uh, Randall. Randall. Jeff, Jeff, Robert, Robert, Slick, Slick, all all these guys <laughs> here, we're we're uh, <laughs> we're staying because of the fact that we have family here. We're all a big family, and um, we're 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 prepared when we're gonna work as late as we can tonight. In the morning, we've got some time. We're gonna try and get everybody we can to safety, security, and uh, we know what we're dealing with. We're all watching the weather. We're all talking. We're all yeah. We're a little bit scared. I understand. You know, this is the biggest storm you know pray for us but more than praying i actually i read a facebook post uh, earlier today and it said uh, the guy i guess he was an atheist or something i'm not sure everybody has their own beliefs so i really don't want to get into what your beliefs are but um everybody talks about praying for people you know praying is, is the first step but if you don't pray and you don't do any action um what is that you know i'm down here we're doing i'm helping everybody i can get their boats ready um having them get their their lives ready everything i mean we moving stuff to second stories moving here moving there um i've got friends calling me from all over the country they're worried about something they have here and they're saying hey can you tie this can you put an extra line on my boat can you put an extra uh bolt in my in my hurricane shutters so you know we're down here we've made the decision we thought was the best decision and um we're, we're in this for the long haul so we're going to be here we're going to have about 24 hours of hell tomorrow probably starting around lunchtime. we're going to do updates as long as we can but um, this is a decision we all made. You know, most of the people that are sending these messages we get um, haven't really lived a day in their life, some of them. Uh, some of them have lived in the past and, and then stopped. They're focused on Facebook, focused on uh, TV, focused on all these different things, you know. We're down here living. We're making these videos to update, let people know what, what the situation is. But um, I hope we don't have to, have to face it. But if we die tomorrow, we all live the fuck amazing lives. And... Um, just want y'all to know we're going to do everything we can to keep ourselves safe. We're going to keep each other safe. We're going to keep the other people around us safe. And uh, But at the same time, we all know what we're facing. We've got a hur huge hurricane coming, and um, we're all ready for it as best we can be. So we appreciate y'all thinking about us. We appreciate y'all praying for us. Um, like I said, later on today, I said, you know, praying is one thing, doing is another. I'm going to try and get a GoFundMe set up. Uh, right now, uh, I'm not really sure exactly how, but... Uh, biggest thing we're going to need is we're going to need supplies we're going to need chainsaws generators uh as soon as this thing's over we're we're going to survive this thing i can guarantee you that but as soon as it's over we're going to need the, the stuff to help this town rebuild we want to get people back to their lives this is what america is about you know everybody coming together and, and making things happen you don't have to be down here actually helping out but a little bit of money a little bit of supplies whatever you can do to help us out to get this thing back to normal uh, once this storms through, everything helps. So keep that in mind. Like I said, y'all keep praying for us. Keep us in your thoughts. I, I believe, I believe uh, all the positive, encouraging energy. No matter what your beliefs are, what God you pray to, all the encouraging energy is is definitely going to be what's going to get us through. Like but uh, 
We, yeah, Key West motto is one human family. We are one human family, and these guys are the ones that are proving it. So we helped everybody we could. I was actually giving gas to people that were leaving, uh, knowing that I might need a little bit for myself, but I, I feel like I've got enough for myself. Um, I've got several hundred gallons on a boat. We've got several hundred gallons of water. We've got all this emergency supplies we need. So as long as the places we're in aren't, aren't blown down, and then like I said, even if that happens, we've got, we've got food and provisions other places, so. <laughs> I know this video went a little long, but thank y'all for watching. Keep us in your prayers, and like I said, do something positive to, uh, if you can't change our lives, change somebody else's life. You know, every day you get a chance to make a difference in somebody's life. Use it. Love y'all. Thank you for watching. Please like and share. Woo!